Hey OG gang 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 trying out this whole lighting with my ring light and this place but let's go what's up OG gang how you been how you been how you been it's been a little while just work with me, work with me. I'm trying my best to keep up with this consistency. Work with me, please. Uh, to all my new subscribers, thank you so much for joining the OG gang. We go places over here. So if you looking for budget stays or luxury stays and you want to know how it go before you reach, just continue checking out this channel as I do my best um, doing what I love to do which is checking out different types of accommodations in different parishes here in Jamaica so if that's up your alley and you haven't subscribed as yet then you can please hit that red subscribe button and officially join the fam also I would like you to not forget to like this video it helps others find my content and yeah it lets me know that you like the content that i am putting on all right so i said let me come on here and give a little tips because there are times where persons ask me a good amount of questions as i do a lot of solo traveling and they um they wanted some tips now what i'm going to talk about today are just essentials essentials for traveling not necessarily only solo traveling but traveling overall so if you're interested in to find out what are some of my essentials most times when i'm traveling then please stay tuned all right so i can group the essentials partially based on where i'm going so if i'm going to an all-inclusive resort or all-inclusive hotel um, I'll, say, I'll insert pictures either to the left or the right of the screen for, um, for different items or maybe all items are some items that I know some persons don't remember how they look or don't know how they look. So when I am going to an all-inclusive hotel, I have to carry my personal bottle of rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol assists me with, let's say, um, I got an insect bite or I feel nauseous or so forth, I can use the they rub in alcohol, I can inhale it. Um, if my, it also could uh, assist as I suffer from my sinusitis. Um, yeah, so rubbing alcohol isn't bad to have. Um, another item that I would have is Pepto Bismal. It's for our drum, my Jamaican people are supposed to know Pepto, Pepto Bismal. That it's pink. I'll insert a picture. It assists with uh, upset stomach, diarrhea, nausea, um, if you overeat, if you're overdrunk, um, you can have that. You can take some of that and it assists, it eases your discomfort. For um, To go with my pepto I would also have one or two packs of Andrews. Most times, I'll be very honest, I don't have to use them, but I am not leaving the house without them. Um, so those have to be, a, those are travel essentials to me. Also, travel essentials, and Amazon is good for this. No plug, but everybody know about Amazon. And you can also get these from maybe Shein. But travel size containers. So what I used to love is that, like when you go to the dentist and you get the nice small, the nice small pack of toothpaste, travel size. I loved, I loved my travel size items. So travel size toothpaste, um, lotion, shampoo, here all of those things. So norm, most most persons have those things in big bottles. So you're like, oh, I want to carry my own stuff, but how am I? You can just buy a container set of Amazon, or you can go to your, your, your nearest wholesale, haberdashery, dollar store, and get those 
containers it um yes with my heart it will be very beneficial to you um yeah those are those are my go-to things especially when i'm going to an all-inclusive hotel because you're prone to either over drinking or overeating or eating something that you never know you're allergic to so i even carry i have dph or um, um i have allergy pills i have it i have dph in liquid and i also travel with pills so that immediately when i feel that i'm allergic to something i just take it and it releases me quickly rather than especially these hotels um then they don't necessarily have they maybe have on site or have on call a nurse or a doctor and most hotels if i'm not mistaken you have to pay that cost so why not bring your own medication to try and help yourself while you are there on vacation um i leave advil pain relievers sinus pills those things are your go-to travel essential it might not be essential to you but judge me or judge me not as a drinker as a rumed as whatever you want to look at it as i carry my personal cup to the all-inclusive hotel my branded personal cup it's much easier i can clean it i sanitize it i know how clean it is it also moves quickly when you're in line they have to maybe wash cups and wait more while you can just fill up your your contain your bottle and you can continue moving continue moving about your business so those are essentials for me for my all-inclusive hotel now essentials when i'm going to a villa or an apartment i have to have my um I still carry those medications but because you're now in control of what you consume more well um, it's not that drastic but um, travel essentials for me when I'm going to like a like a villa um, my friends say Olivia you're walking with extra weight but it's just personal preference I don't really know the place so sometimes I carry my own bathing rug um carry my own bathing rug carry my own soap and um sometimes i carry my own towel um yes pictures you're like oh but you look up the pictures you're supposed to have an idea of how it looks and that is true but it's just a personal preference so those are travel essentials for me bringing my own rug and sometimes my own towel that's just me um yeah that's that's just me and you know most villas also um well within the life of this pandemic you will may want to travel with the small bottle of Lysol or anything that you can use or same rubbing alcohol and you can clean down the place to make it feel more homely and safe for you um those are travel essentials you know your hand sanitizer can't leave you know um extra pairs of masks i put them in a clear bag and they're in my bag ready to go other little travel essentials um well some person might call them random some persons might not call it essentials but i cannot go without my glasses my shades i need a pair of sun glasses with me comment down below if you're one of those sunglasses persons but even if i'm not going to wear it for the whole time my sunglasses has to be there my sunglasses has to be there um my selfie ring light has to come with me from i got it as a gift it has never left my bag once i'm going on a trip you never really know when you're going to need to use it so and it's small so you can just you know just put it to one side and you're good to go right um, so yeah, those are just some of my travel essentials. There may be more, but that's what's come to my mind that I deem as important. Sunglasses, self ring light, pepto -bismol, allergy pills, rubbing alcohol. Um, of course, maybe a small bottle of Lysol or rubbing the same rubbing alcohol can be utilized to clean down surfaces due to this pandem pandemic. You, you're more conscious um extra mass in a bag 
within a bag. Um, yeah, those are travel essentials for me. Also, um, pouches. So, pouches. I you you will separate you can separate your phone separate certain things and your like mini handbag so for example ladies you have a big handbag with everything right when you're going to your location but when you're going to just go and walk and down of course you have a small handbag so you would have your small handbag and different pouches with different either cash or card so you don't have to walk with everything. So you can put up things safely and walk with what you need instead of walking up and down with everything that is important, right? Including um, persons, my persons who are leaving from other islands and conscious about their passport and so forth. Have your separate pouches and you put up what you need securely in like a suitcase or so forth. And then you just walk with what you need, your card, in your small bag you know instead of walking up and down with your passport and all of those things not really necessary that's that's a little dangerous you know but I mean if it if it's that's what you have to do that's what you have to do but that's just my two cents um so that's it for this video quick short spicy with my two cents I do hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. May I wait for none of you subscribe, you know. We say thank you, we passed 500 subs, you know. We are on our way to 1000 subscribers. And fill up the comment section. I want to hear what you have to say. I want to hear if you have any video suggestions for me. Let me know, gang. Let me know, alright. Peace. Oh, 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 oh,